Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. So I don't know how this is gonna sound. I know it's very windy, so it might sound like very like this is a lot of audio. Long story short, as you guys can see the title of this video, I don't even know what I'm gonna title it. I have we have this little shed that nobody really uses uses. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna transform this into a nursery slash greenhouse. Not a nursery, but a greenhouse. Anyways, so I'm just gonna like show you guys the process. We've done way more i just ended up like thinking i should film it and, and actually document it so here i am cutting this little pile of um branches we already tried it with these so we can put it on the two buckets we've already cut like four trees or five trees not including the front so yeah it's, it's been pretty fun so let's start with the time lapse This is the mini greenhouse. It was a shed. We ended up changing it into a mini, well, it's not that small, but a greenhouse. And I'm measuring the light. And it's not that bad right now. It's a pretty cloudy day. But when the sun is out, it gets like halfway. So that's pretty good. We got a lot of cleaning to do. We're gonna like use the rocks to make some tables. Hey guys, as you guys can see, I am in this shed and I'm gonna make it into a, I don't know, I don't know what, I, I don't know what I'm thinking, I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I really, I had some plants that were dying and a while back and I ended up placing them outside and they've been growing like crazy and I kind of want to put some of my plants outdoors as well. The thing is, I don't want to put them like on the front porch and I was thinking maybe I can place it in the shed where like nobody puts their stuff and it's just dark and it's just there and nobody's using it. So I was like, let me make it into like a mini sanctuary where I can put all of my precious plants and, and plants that are not doing so good as well. So that's what I might do on this video. I'm not that sure yet. I don't know if that's what I want to do. I'm a little bit undecisive. It might be a good thing. I'm pretty sure because, you know, in the natural habitat, they're out outdoors in the warm. And like I said, I live in Texas. It's always warm in here. Um, it is a bit dry, but I'm pretty sure if I water the plants like every single day, they might stay like moist and like it, it will be like a micro environment, like a humid environment. So yeah, I need to like organize this shed and there's no shelves or tables yet. So I need to put some shelves and tables in here. <laughs> but like I said, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I really, really want to put my plants in here. I feel like they're going to enjoy life. It's going to be a lot fun and therapeutic to come in here and edit some videos or sip my coffee or just like do tours. I don't know. Like I said, I just hope everything's going to work out. I was going to add a plastic on top, but we're having so many issues. So I might just leave it like empty um there is a tree on the top i feel like it's not gonna be that bad because it is like shaded throughout the entire day it looks like a little bit of morning light but it's not like you know very intense direct light so yeah let me put you guys on the tripod do a time lapse and see what i'm gonna do i don't know <laughs> So as you guys can see, I picked up the rocks and some mess that I saw on the floor. There's still like a bit more mess. I might need to go to um, Walmart and buy a a longer water hose because like it's not gonna reach. So yeah, because I want to like pressure wash the sides and remove some of like the and some other stuff. And then after that, I want to use my shelves and see how it looks in here and see how it turns out.
video guys so that is it for this video let me give you guys like a mini update i actually enjoyed watering all of the plants it was really therapeutic on like bottom watering and i just love how like the water droplets are all over the leaves with the sun hitting it So this wood, this piece of wood was in the inside over here and I was like, I don't want to toss it. I can actually use it for a table to put plants on top of it. So that is exactly what we ended up doing. It was also bricks and we used them to support the table, well, the wood. So we can make it into a table for plants. Now it doesn't get direct sunlight in this shed and there's like a tree right, at, right on top of it so it's in the shade Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.